All right, guys. So we got some Fritos, and then I browned some ground beef because we're making a walk-in taco today. Got my crock pot on high. Get all of that deliciousness in there. All right, then we're gonna add some Rotel. You can use the spicy kind and leave the juice in there. You want that to soak in your chips just a little. I also have some black beans. I took out most of the juice. Uh oh. For the black beans, you don't want that much juice to where your chips are super duper soggy. Alright, then we are going to add some corn. Because we're getting a little festive here. I'm not going to add the whole can. Just going to add probably like three fourths of a can. And then I am going to add some jalapenos because I like a little spicy with my taco. Probably add a couple of spoonfuls. Now, instead of using jalapenos, you can use green chilies as well with no spice, just extra flavor. Then I have some diced red onions. You can use white onion as well. And I love onions, so I'm probably going to go overboard on this. But this is at your discretion. You can use as much or as little as you like. A little bit more. Ah. And then we're going to add some minced garlic. Now, I love, love, love garlic as well, so I'm probably going to add a couple of tablespoons. You can use more or less, and then we're going to top this all off with some taco seasoning. Now, they have different variations of taco seasoning, hot, mild, spicy. Um, we just got the original. So depending on what spice level you want, um, you can use that one. And I have the jalapenos in there, so that's why I just wanted to use the original. All right. Now we're going to leave the chips at the bottom. We're going to try not to crush them. Um, we're just going to mix all those things up. Mm. This smells so good already, and it hasn't even really started cooking. I have my uh, crock pot already on high, but this already smells delicious. All right, I think I got my taco seasoning mixed up in there already pretty good. Just gonna level that out and like I said I got my crock pot on high we'll probably leave this in here for about 45 minutes or so let all those flavors incorporate and we will see you back in a minute all right guys we're back and look at that We this smells absolutely divine. So what we're gonna do is we are going to add in some cheese here. Oh man, this smells so good. Now, you can um, do this step individually if you like. But, you know, everybody I know loves cheese, so we're going to eat this all together. Just going to give that a little stir for our walking taco. Right. Now I got my 
my plate because this is gonna be delicious and we gotta get a dollop of daisy some sour cream for our taco we like our tacos cream Mmm. Mmm. That sour cream sets it off. Mmm. -hmm. Y'all have to try this off. Mmm. -hmm. 